some people, but if you want to face your fears, there's a way to prepare it that's really good, and we're going to cook some liver and onions today. Liver is a very good source of protein, iron, potassium, and it also contains folate. So it's one of your most nutritious foods, but it's something that we don't eat a lot of in our daily American diets. So you can incorporate it into your diet this way with liver and onions, and we can also serve it with some mashed turnips or mashed potatoes. And the really American way to eat it, the traditional way, is with a side of sweet peas. The texture's a little bit scary, but it's a really good dish. It's really uh, very nutritious, and it's also very economical to feed your family. You wanna make sure before you cook your liver, you soak it in milk for at least 40 minutes very cold milk in the refrigerator is best. It takes out some of the metallic taste that liver tends to have and makes it more palatable. Okay, so what I've done, I've got some butter and oil in this pan and it's really, really hot. We've got some pieces of our sliced calf's liver and some seasoned flour. We've just dredged it a little bit and we're gonna add it to the hot oil. And this flour is going to make kind of a little gravy base. It's basically making its own gravy. Now that our liver has browned on both sides, we've got a good little base in there. We're going to add in some of our onions. And we've got a mix of Vidalia and uh, purple onion, kind of like that LSU colors, real festive. And you can add as much or as little as you want. The onions cook down and they get a little bit sweet. It makes a really, really good dish. We've got our liver and onions in the pot. We're going to add in a little bit of beef stock. All coming together. One thing about liver is you don't want to overcook it. It's really tough. So like all good South Louisiana cooks, we're going to add just a little bit of Cajun seasoning to taste. And you could do this however you like. If you just like salt and pepper, do it that way. I like a little bit of um, granulated garlic in mine. So we've got a little bit of that. And looks like our liver and onions is ready to taste. Okay, so I'm facing my scary food fear. I'm tasting my liver and onions. It's very good. Doable. Good. I like it. So try this at home. It's really good, really easy. Cooks very quick. Liver and onion.